Well, it's not another get dressed with get dressed with me today because I'm sitting down and I'm going to be sharing some of my Kurt Geiger handbag collection. You know, my sister came to me and she said, "Do you know many Kurt Geigers you have?" And I said, uh, "You know, I have a few." She said, "Sure, and you have more than a few." And she proceeded to count them and she said to me, "You have almost 30 Kurt Geiger handbag in different dimensions." She, so she said, "You should share them." So I decided to do that. If you've not already followed me, I hope you're following me. I hope you subscribe. Um, I'm doing these video. I'm doing these videos to docu document my 2023 no spend. And the reason that I decided not to spend <laughs> and do any shopping in 2023 is because I got a lot of stuff. And I've decided that I am going to make a concerted effort to wear everything I have. I'm going to start off today with just showing just a few just a few of the my Kurt Geiger handbag. I think maybe one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. I'm gonna be showing eight. I think one of them is doubled up. Eight or nine of them today. And then I'll do a part two or maybe a part three because I don't want it to be too overwhelming with all of them all at once. And also, um, I'll also share some of my other um, handbags that I have. I have a lot of vintage, um, um, handbags that I actually prefer the vintage stuff but in any event let's get started so when I discovered Kurt Geiger I kind of went hog wild over the Kurt Geiger handbag and I started out first with the with the mini bag the crossover bag because I do so much traveling I wanted you know bags that um, are easy to travel with crossover and not a big deal so let's go let's see here let's pull this one out his bags are so, so interesting. Oh my goodness, look at this. It still has the uh, plastic protection on it. I'm gonna be honest, I have never used this bag. Let me come up close so you can see. I have never worn this bag and I've had it for a while. But it's the artistry for me with Kurt Geiger. Look at that. I'm gonna need the protection on there until I actually wear it. I need to stuff it because it's sinking in and I don't like that. I'm surprised I don't have it stuffed here. But in any event, look at this bag. Isn't it beautiful? I mean, it is stunning. I don't remember where I got it from and I don't remember how much I paid for it, but I, I felt like it was art. You know, art on a handbag and I fell in love with it, so I ordered it. I am going to wear it because, like I said, it's a great little crossbody bag when you're traveling, and um, to just you know you want to put a little your, your your wallet and your keys and 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 so forth in it. But I think this bag is absolutely stunning. So this is one of them. Okay. Here's another one. <laughs> I think I fell in love with Kurt Geiger because of the owl. I think it's so cute. Now this one I have worn. I have worn this one quite a bit. It's, I consider it a neutral. I love the different um, shades on it. Um, and that's the thing with Kurt Geiger. It's just the, the uniqueness of it, the styling. I, I, I really, really, really love this designer. So I've worn this um, quite a bit, and I think I have pictures with me styling and how I wore this bag, and I'll um, insert those pictures in here with this bag. I I do have this one stuff. I'm so surprised I don't have this one stuff because all my bags are stuff. Gonna rectify that. And here it is. Oh, and it, it has ample room. Let me bring it up close. Look at that. I mean. It has ample room in it that you could put a wallet, your phone, let's see. You could put your, like, you know how UG's phone, you could put your phone in there, a small wallet, your keys, and that's really all you need when you're out and about sometimes. You don't need a whole, a, you know, a big bag with a whole lot of stuff. You just need a cute little bag that just fits everything you need. I know. This, this small bag is going away and they're bringing them back to big, big bags. <laughs> and I will say, I personally love a big bag. 
However, when you're traveling, when I, and I do a lot of traveling, when I travel, my mini bag, my crossbody bag is what I need because I don't want to be, you know, going around Europe with this humongous bag. No. Alrighty. So that's the second little bag. Now here it is. Let's see what's in this bag. Oh yeah. I thought I needed a little mini go bag. I don't have this one stuffed in. I'm surprised. I, 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 and I haven't worn this one yet. But I will wear it. <laughs> and Because I, I said, when I saw this, I'm like, oh, this is perfect. You could get a, a little mini gold metallic bag, you know, um, when you're traveling and you have on an outfit and you want something to go with everything. This will be ideal. So that's why I, when I saw this one, I got it. And I think I got this one from Nordstrom's. This one, I definitely know I got it from um, Nordstrom's. This one, I think I got this one from Nordstrom's, Nordstrom Rack. I'm not 100% sure, but I think I did. I uh, don't remember the price point. Um, I've had all of these bags, you know, that I'm showing you at least at a minimum two years. So don't remember prices. But again, ample room, your phone, a little wallet, and your keys. And that's all you need. So this is my third little um, mini bag. Oh, the mini bag continue. Okay, here's another one. I thought this blush, uh, is it salmon? I initially thought it was pink, but I think it's more salmon. And I've actually worn this one. I do have this one stuff. And um, I consider this a great neutral. You know, for me, this is a great neutral because I wear a lot of color. And sometimes you need something to kind of like tone the colors down. And I think this bag fits the bill. It's just, I love these little bags. I'm sorry, I'm still stuck struggling with my sniffies. They are, they, they are just absolutely perfect in my eyes. Not to mention, I mean, when you look at this one and this one, the artwork, the art, artist, artistry of it all. Love that. Okay, let's see, what else do we have here? Oh my goodness. Ooh. Like I said, you know, even when you shop and you buy stuff, <laughs> and you kind of become a collector, and you don't realize what you have until my sister brought it to my attention, I really, really love this one. It's beautiful. Let me bring it up. Look at it. I just absolutely love this one. The, the design, and I have worn this one quite a bit um, because I, I just love it. The colors, it, it, it literally, if you have on an outfit and you just you could just throw this one on pick up any of the colors in here and it works perfectly like i said i i just love to throw these on crossbody if i'm wearing my white shirt and my blue jeans my splash of color this is it white shirt blue jeans my splash of color crossbody as i'm running around this is perfect and i especially love the designs that you know that have the owl on them i have some of them with the lock, but the designs with the owl, love them. Absolutely love them. So here's another one of my Kurt Geiger mini bag. All right, let's see what else we got. What we got, what we got, any more minis? Let's see what's in this bag. And I keep all of my bags in bags. <laughs> I, I just like to protect them that way because when you have so much stuff, I, I do. I just keep them all in bags. Now this one, um, I don't remember where I got this one from. I can't, anyhow. But more than likely, it may, if it's not Dillard's, it's Nordstrom Rack. This one I specifically remember I got from Nordstrom Rack and I was so happy when I found it because this one is clear. It's a see-through, I have it stuffed. And it's perfect for when you go to, you know, a game. They want you to have those the clear see-through bag. 
and this one I thought it was a clear see-through bag with style so that was the, the reason why I got this I was going to a a, um, a football game and I didn't want to just get one a plastic you know those ugly I can't those plastic bag and I saw this and the outfit that I was wearing this one perfectly with the outfit so that's why I got it and I got this one from um, Nordstrom Rack Yeah, so this is this one. Look at the owl. I mean, my favorite thing about her guider, the owl. And this again could go with a multitude of colors and outfits. Perfect. Alrighty, what else we got? Okay, so I think that these are my minis. Now we're gonna get into the medium size bag in the um but I love this bag there will definitely be a picture insert of me wearing this bag because I know I have it because I wear this bag I've worn it quite a bit <sighs> look at it I mean just 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 look at it the owl the pop the color the orange on the chain What else can I say? I absolutely love this bag. And look at, I mean, this is a medium size. It's not the really large. This is, this is actually the perfect um, daily wear, you know, going into the office, running around, because it holds a lot. I have a stuff with paper. It's, it, it, it can hold a lot. But this, for me, when I saw this one, it was the owl right here and the orange. I think, I think, I think, I think I got this one from Dillard's. Yes. Love this one. Oh, okay. So what else do we have here? Oh, yeah. I'm trying to remember if I have the, my very first Kurt Geiger. I don't. But, wait a minute. No, it wasn't this. Was it this one? I can't remember. I can't remember which, if this was the first one. But as you can see, another one. I, 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 I didn't realize how many Kurt Gardens I have. Like I said, until my sister counted. And um, I'm gonna be showing you nine today. So there will be a part two, maybe a part three of the whole collection. So in this showing, I'm showing my minis and then the tweed, this kind of tweedy color ones with the different colors. I mean, look, look, look at this. Look at the work. It has the little, um, what do you call it? Stones inserted in the fabric. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. And I, I should have a picture of this one also because I have styled this one quite a bit. As a matter of fact, I love this one so much and I was so happy when I got it. I showed it to my sister and she hunted and hunted. She found one similar, not exactly. I think hers just have the black and white stripes or something like that with the stones in them. She didn't have the multicolored one with the stones in it, but this one, absolutely love, stunning. And let's see here. The last Kurt Geiger bag <laughs> that I'm gonna to show today is this one. I remember when I found this one. I found it at Dillard's. <sighs> And I said, if this doesn't scream summer, I don't know what does. The flower, the straw, the multi, the multicolor, ample. Look, look, look at the inside. 
the inside alone just makes you happy. Oh, I remember the day I found this one because I found it at Dillard's in Atlantic Station. And I was carrying my, um, my LV. I'm gonna do a collection about my, my LV also. I have a lot of vintage LV. And I was carrying my LV and I saw this bag, fell in love with it, purchased it, and immediately took the stuff that I had in my LV out, put it in this bag, and this was the bag I carried for the rest of the day. That's why I remember it so vividly. I love this. This bag just screamed summer to me. Absolutely love it. The inside just makes you happy. Makes me happy. <laughs> So, this is a few of my Kurt Geiger handbags, like I said. <laughs> I have about 30 of them, so this is part one. I'll make a part two. I don't know if I'll break it up in um, another part or two more and share those with you. Of all the things that I'm gonna miss, I'm an avid thrifter, but of all the things I'm gonna miss shopping and getting Kurt Geiger. Uh, when I discovered Kurt Geiger's, every one of them I saw, I, I had to sometimes pull myself and sure you can't buy it, you can't buy it, you, have, you already have enough. I am hoping he doesn't come out with anything this year that I want because 2023 is a no shop year for me. <laughs> it's gonna hurt, it's gonna hurt. This part, this part is gonna hurt, but you know what? I'm gonna hang tough. I'm gonna hang tough. <laughs> I'm gonna live vicariously through my sister because she's already have her eye on two that she's telling me about and I'll just watch her I'll live vicariously through her and you know not shop in 2023. But in any event, I hope you enjoyed this and thank you for you know spending some time with me as I talk about a few of my Kurt Geiger bag. I hope you subscribe, like, comment and share and you know follow along this year with me i really really appreciate you joining me to joining me today and until the next time bye, -bye.